I'm, I'm shooting video. Oh, got it. Okay. First, what are you wearing? You look majestic. Thank you. I'm wearing Beyond B styled by Gabriel Garmin. Yeah. What are one of the things that's so spectacular about this year for the Tonys is people like yourself who are are people of color behind the scenes whose faces we don't always see that are nominated. Talk about uh, your elation when you found out you were nominated. Wow. Well, I was actually asleep. Um, you know, people say, "Well, why weren't you awake for the nomination?" <laughs> and I said, "I wanted to be at peace, no matter what. You don't, you don't know how it's going to go." Um, so I was really amazed and shocked when my best friends called me saying that I was nominated, and it took me about five minutes to actually believe them. And what's it like working with with a double nominee in in, in Jeremy and, and and the fantastic job that he did? Oh my goodness! It's just I mean his Broadway debut two nominations. I'm just so proud and happy for him. And I'm also happy for the whole cast of Choir Boy. They worked so hard. It was a dream to work with them. What's some words of advice that you would give to people of color behind the scenes like yourself who are striving to be here next year in five years? Uh, never never give up. There was a question um, that I was having a discussion with people about visibility and invisibility. And um, I said that you are visible to people that need to see you. So even when you don't feel like you are seen, know that um, people do see you in the community. Thank you.